This is a driverless pod system, which is a way of getting passengers from the car park at Terminal 5 into the airport. And the great thing about it is it means that we can reduce the number of buses we have going around the airport, which reduces emissions, um, because these cars work without any electricity being generated on the site and therefore no emissions on the site. The system now has replaced all those buses, which means we've taken out about 50,000 bus journeys. Compared to a bus where typically you have a 10 minute schedule and you have to wait, the pod is available immediately. The vehicles are all launched autonomously. There are two berths immediately behind me. There's another two at the other end of the car park when you leave. And the vehicle is looking through four lasers on either side of the guideway to make sure it's in the right place. The technology and the innovative bit is the control system and the control technology on the vehicle. This is a huge innovation, not just within the UK, but internationally. It also allows us to free up the roads around Heathrow, which increasingly get congested as more people use the airport, and reduce the level of carbon emissions. And that's really important for the people who live in and around Heathrow. It's a system of 3.8 kilometres of track. There's 21 of the vehicles. Those vehicles are electric. They run a small motor, lead acid batteries. The vehicles typically use 70% less energy than, than a car would. This is the world first that Heathrow is proud to be involved with. It's something that's been talked about for 40 years, the idea that you can have driverless vehicles that will take you from any point to any other point. Um, and we've pioneered it here at Heathrow. It's been a fantastic experience for all of us who've been involved with it. In terms of where the system could go in the future, we're really excited here at Ultra about having got our pilot up and running at Heathrow and starting to develop with a number of partners around the world some potential projects and applications for the system. It quickly gets you to your destination without the need for heavy infrastructure. We're actively working with partners to, to see if we can get this innovative British technology out to the market. We're really excited that finally uh, it has come to fruition and passengers can use the pod system live. The first time I used it, I was helped by some of the, the people that work here. It was fairly easy to use because they sort of uh, walk you through the whole process. Uh, I found it really easy to use because the touch screen is really easy to understand. We take three, four people. Generally I'm on my own, but I have been with colleagues before and three of us have got in there you know, with luggage and it hasn't been a problem. It took me five minutes from start to finish and I did not have to wait at all. It was quite clean and smart and fast and much quicker than waiting for a coach. When the idea of saving 50,000 bus journeys a year has got to be a great thing. And the main thing I like is the fact that it's so eco-friendly. For the first time, it was simple to use, very intuitive. I think it's fun, actually. <laughs> it's quite funny getting a little pod and being driven by yourself. Very easy to use, very reliable and, and actually a pleasure, really.